All right. Let's see. I think this is the first one I want to do. Oh boy, that's right. I ended on Target Town, except that I've already done it with the hardest weapon, so this should be fine. Is this the day we finally beat story mode? Ah! Uh... Yes. Rapid Blaster. Fortunately, I've already done it with the most difficult weapon, so this should be easy. Destroy the targets. Hopefully my aim is on point today. I feel a bit swimmy. You know what I mean? Oh, that's a... No, no, no. Okay, it's fine. No, it's not fine. <laughs> See, I did this one first try last time. And already... Already... See, I wasn't close enough. I gotta, I gotta remember that the blaster's got a, a little bit of a shorter range. I am doing 100%. I'm doing uh, every every level with every weapon. Yes, sir, Bob. I don't know why I've decided to do this, but I committed to it at the beginning, and so I just got to keep going, I guess. <laughs> it would feel really wrong to just skip World 5. See, the key with this one is shoot at the egg. Oh, that's right. You gotta like duck and cover through the grate. What am I doing? What am I doing? This is gonna take me all night. If I play like this. That's true. I don't have to do this. But here we are. Yeah, the stringer is the hardest one. You can tell the difficulty because they're, they're in order of difficulty. So if there's like three weapons available for that level. Oh, shit. F. This is a warm up. This is a warm up. <laughs> Hi, Iggy. How's it going, buddy? How did I do this first try last time? Uh, I don't know. I'm a gamer. I used my gamer powers. Look, I can't. I can't tell you more. You know, I can't reveal my secrets, Trill. Your existing mood. That's kind of me today. I'm feeling very low energy today. Like, I'm feeling good, though. Like, I'm in a positive mood. I'm just feeling very low in energy. I've expended a lot of mental energy lately, this week. I've had to get a lot of things done that are, like, important to life. Like, I booked a doctor's appointment. And I did some other, like, paperwork shit. And what else did I do? I don't know, some money management shit. That's true. Yesterday was also tense as fuck. Like, some of those last matches were, like, insane, actually. What happened to Josh's bad at video games? Uh, I'm great at video games. I don't know what you're talking about. I've never been bad at video games. You're crazy. I have no idea what you're talking about, truly. Yeah. Sounds good, Iggy. Have fun with games. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, that was significantly easier than with the Tri-Stringer. Although, I did do the Tri-Stringer in one shot, so was it? I don't know.
It's a flat out lie. Everyone here knows it. I genuinely don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you beat it with the hardest weapon? What do you mean? In the first try? Yes. Correct. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this one, first try. I, my, my aim was real good that day. Oh, this one, see, now I can't just shoot at the, the eggs. I have to actually hit the targets. So this actually is harder, I would say. Josh is a bot in the weirdest places I know. I surprise myself sometimes. That was close. I need, I, oh. Spray and pray, motherfuckers. That's true, I've got range too, that makes it easier. Yeah, I love how you can be an Octoling too. I mean, Octolings, the, the thing that people need to remember about Octolings, they weren't added until the Octo expansion came out. <laughs> so like they weren't even there at, in Splatoon 2, like at the beginning. So, no, no, no. Got him, somehow. Got him. Woo! That last that last shot is a dicey one though. Jump on the rail of stall. Nah, I didn't need it. Good advice. But I didn't need it. I'm too much of a gamer. Alright. Let's see what we got. Which ones haven't I done? Oh, there's only a couple more. Low vis, high risk. <clears throat> stick controls or motion? I'm good with motion. I have a friend who has the more than me with stick control. Let's just say that. Um, I think motion is is better, but I understand that it is a learning curve for people. And if you can't get over that learning curve, then the stick controls are the next best thing. But I think that the motion lends itself to quicker aiming and more precise aiming. And also, really, when you say motion, what you really mean is stick and motion because you don't, you, you only use motion for the up and down. Like up and down is really what you want. You can go left and right, but it's really kind of a pain in the dick to do that. So use the stick for left and right and the motion for up and down, and it's just way better. Hi, Jamie. Thank you for the resub. See those Jeps and Jiggies in chat when we get resubs, you guys. You guys, you guys, give me those jiggies. They cute. Mouse motion sticks. Yeah, let's just play Splatoon with the mouse and keyboard. 
Can we do that? <laughs> Honestly, I actually struggle with mouse aiming. Like, it's not worse than sticks. Like, it's clearly better. But I'm not as good with stick or with uh, mouse aiming as I as I should be. One of the things you miss out on, and people don't talk about this enough, one of the things you miss out on with um, with mouse and keyboard is that the movement like of your actual character, not talking about aiming, but your actual movement is worse. And with sticks, with dual stick controls, you can adjust your aiming more precisely by slightly moving your character left and right or forward and back. So that's that's something that not enough people talk about. Like that's how that's how stick aiming is still pretty competitive. Beagle boy, Beagle boy, welcome in. Thanks for the sub. Brand new sub too. Love to see that. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Working our way up slowly to that nuts and bolts. Press exit jump is objectively better, but some are just too used to up to jump. I can't. Up to jump doesn't make sense to me in that game because there are attacks that you need to press up on the stick for. So like, how does one do those attacks properly without jumping? I don't know. Up to jump just seems silly to me. Oh, hell yeah, Beagle Boy. Love to see it. Helping us, helping the Jepsons conquer the, the internet. Thank you. Ah, shite! You monster. Oh, this is gonna be slow and bad. We're gonna take our time. How did you not get hit? Did you move? Idiot. I like I like stick aiming a lot cuz I mean I my my first ever first person shooter was Halo 3. Well, I mean kind of. I, I definitely played some first person shooters on like on the N64 like GoldenEye and stuff like that, but I never owned GoldenEye. My cousin did, and so I played it very little at his house. And those older first person shooters didn't play well to begin with in my opinion. And it took me a long time to grapple my head around first person aiming with dual sticks. It took me a long time. So I think that mouse and keyboard is just more intuitive in that way. Did you guys know that my buddy Hal Diamond plays inverted in first person shooters? Up is down, down is up. I've tried it once. I actually got used to it for a while playing uh, Fallout 3 with that on. Yeah. Well, so the reason why so he's a he's a he uh, he's a pilot, and um, and it, that's how it is with planes. So he's he he was used to that before even getting really that deep into first person shooters. But I tried it once and I got I kind of I kind of actually got used to it and liked it for a while. I I got to the point where I I couldn't play first person shooters normally for a while. <laughs> oh shit. Here, you know what? We're going to do we're going to do this. Twister time. Oh shit. I don't think I got any of them. Oh, okay, yeah, I did. Perish. Oh, 
Oh, this, this, this is the worst, though. Ow. Played some playing games, so I got used to inverted and feels wrong to use normal. Yep. That's exactly it. So I get it. I, at first, I was like, how could you even do this? And then I got used to it. And that shows the value of learning other people's perspectives, kids. I used to make fun of him for having inverted control. Now, you know what the real wild thing is? Horizontal axis being inverted. I don't know. I don't. You're out of your mind if you do that. <laughs> I don't even think that's a thing. All right. Another shooter on rails. Let's go. <laughs> if you invert the x-axis, you are literally Satan. That's what I'm saying. Whoa. Oh, that was sick, actually. More target practice. Oh, that's okay. It's a good thing that my shots explode, because I definitely missed. Southpaw. Yeah, Southpaw. Oh, that was close. Oh, my, I'm sorry. I was distracted by Nick saying that he wants to be a hot, fiery daddy. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Stop paying attention to me. Okay. Ignoring Nick for the rest of the night. Let's go. Oh. Just pay attention to me. No, I refuse. Oh man, I just realized. Oh, uh, that's why I was screwing it up. Because you notice how the reticle goes upwards a little bit when you, whenever you, whenever you fully charge it. That was confusing. I think it's because it gives you more range on it. Oh yeah, I have a burst bomb too, huh? That was helpful. <laughs> Woo! Oh, it was down there. Did I miss? Oh, I did. I missed the ones on the back. Yo, what's up, Tim? Vimo, indeed. Never fought like the burst those flat bombs help very much on any of the rail stages. Always too much ink to do almost nothing. Yeah, yeah. They're honestly, I actually don't like the burst bomb that much, even in like normal multiplayer. I find that it's like it's good if you're like supplementing it with your shots or whatever, but it's just not it's not that helpful. In my opinion. I'd much rather have a burst bomb or like a torpedo or Hell, even a fizzy bomb. Yo, Korean barbecue! With another gift sub. Let's go. Thank you. 
350. We're at 350 out of 666 now. Looking pretty spicy. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, if you get enough damage in. Oh, no. I missed. <laughs> Which bomb did you say you like? Just the normal splat bomb is the one that I like the best. I like the sheer power of it. But I also like all of the other bombs. Like, I like the torpedo, and I like the the fizzy bomb. Fizzy bomb's probably my least favorite of those ones, those three. But I, I still like it. I like it because it, it's got good... Um... No, no, no. Did like. Do like. I do like the bomb. I don't like the burst bomb as much. That's the one I was talking about. Sorry. The burst bomb. This one. Shit! Let's go. Surf Clay, thank you. One more week until Nuts and Bolts gets nutted. It's true. We may, we may not reach the goal. Hey, you know what? We'll do our best. We're, we have streams every day this week, so let's make it happen, chat. Get those gift subs on. Oh, I forgot to get the one on the back again. Oops. Oh, I forgot to get the one on the back. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah, no, I know. I, I yeah, I I also briefly, Colton, I briefly felt the same way. I was like, oh shit. Wait, no, I changed that. <laughs> Nuts and bolts one hundred percent would be on this channel live if we were to reach that goal. Speaking of upgrading, can I upgrade anything? Do I have that ability? Do we have this technology? No. No. Not until the next level. I do have all of these alternal log alternal logs that I should read at some point too. I don't think I've read any of them. Okay, two more weapons, one more level. You'll go far if you shoot far. One of them is a roller. So I'm very concerned about that one. <laughs> How does one get up there? Oh, they don't. Never mind. It's just eggs. Honestly, I didn't realize that the ball point was actually kind of this fun to use. One of the things that I like about it is that you can charge it. Like when it starts running out. 
Like, you don't have to wait till it goes all the way down. It's pretty great. Have a bomb. Uh, have... Have another bomb. <laughs> Hell no, you're not doing that? That's what I'm doing. Because I'm a gamer. Josh is doing it so we don't have to. I mean, you don't get anything for it, so it's kind of useless. I wish you got something for it. That would be cool. But, like, even just a little bonus, like an extra, I don't know, decoration or something for your locker would be nice. Ooh, a Grizzco locker. Kind of neat. If you don't do it, then you basically steamroll the story. Yeah, it's not very long. I was trying to like, so when I was at dinner, Steven was asking me, he's like, how long is that game? I was like, it's not that long. Of course, I'm making it extra long for me. Roller time, baby. Octobots, roll out. Octobots. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Okay. Just slightly more annoying than the last one. KB gifting us up to Nintendo Nerd. That's cute. Shit, bro, you cute. Damn. It does have decent range, but it's slow as fuck. I kind of hate it. How the fuck do we want to? Okay, that works. Oops, I don't think that's going to work. The Wombo. The Combo. This music is hilarious. We're going the slow, long way. We're just going to walk there. Nice. Nice. 
it's literally just gibberish all the time. All the characters speak in a gibberish language. All right. So that does mean that I've cleared every level, right? Yes. So onwards to area six, I guess. Is that this way? Does this go? Yeah, okay. There's the number six on the thing. Here we go. Oh, boy. Is this one the farthest one out? Sure feels like it. What was that in the water? I thought I saw something. What? I'm sure we'll find out when we get there, for better or worse. I don't like the sound of that. Huh, I see lots of sea, but there's hardly any land. I wonder how long it's been like this. Oh, hey. I'm getting a whole bunch of readings from the top of that weird building over there. That's got to be Gramps. Come on, Agent 3. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. But first, I have to cover the whole ground in my, in my goo. In order to 100% everything. It's fine. Receive my goo. Oh my god! much goo Thanks KB Yo, look at that. Silver Star and Xander got gifted us up tonight. Thank you, thank you. Justice really need to use the bathroom. Don't blame him. I did. I'm just peeing everywhere. Hi, Dragon Master. Welcome in. Welcome in. All right. Bet you missed us. <laughs> Ain't gonna be a single person unsubbed in this chat. Yeah, KV's going after everybody that doesn't have a sub tonight. That's wild. Even a brand new people. Love that. I think that's great too, because that's like really encouraging to people who are new to the channel to come back. If they if they if they get gifted a sub by somebody who's been here for seven years, you know? <laughs> or however long you've been here, KB. <laughs> Try to get that two hundred badge. How close are you? I have no idea. Cause you don't have your badge on right now. Uh, yeah, we'll just go with the hero gear for this one. Uh-oh, what's happening? What's happening? Defeat the enemies sneaking around in the mist and reach the goal. Oh, it's the Octolings. Isn't it? The Octo Crew squad. Oh, maybe not. Oh, it is! Yeah! Oh, my God. I love how the end is right there. Tantalizingly close. Let's go. The Octoling agents are so cool. I love their outfits. Oh, this is kind of scary, actually, seeing them, like, roll around in the mist.
Got he. Wait, what? They just jump off the side? I would have loved to fight him on this tiny little platform. Yeah, I'm here to rain on your parade. That wasn't too bad. This is level made by Stephen King. Wow. Yo, thanks, KB. Let's go. Wow. Wow. Wow, indeed. All right. Should I just go, since this is the final level, should I just do all three at once instead of coming back to it later? I think I'm going to do that. That's what I'm going to do for this, for this world. I'm going to do all three, like, when I get to that level. That way it's already checked off by the time I get to the end. That way we can just end the game when we get to the end instead of going back and redoing levels. I think that makes sense. It's gonna get a little repetitive, but that's okay. That's something I wanted to avoid, but I'd rather I'd rather have everything be done by the time I get to like the final boss area. You hiding? <laughs> well, I don't even know what that Octoling was trying to do just now. But whatever it was, it wasn't working. Oh, man. I'm not good with the Clash Blaster. Clearly. Oh, because you hold it to rapid fire. I didn't realize... Oh, listen, I've never used the Clash Blaster in my life, so... You have to understand... <laughs> Oh, I died. Oops. Oh, I died again. What did they did he throw a bomb at me? Jesus. And this is why I don't use the Clash Blaster. <laughs> I guess it's good that I'm being forced to use it. I'm a little bit afraid to do the hard one. <laughs> I'm a little bit afraid to do the hardest one. Oh, but it's, oh, but see, but see, I like the Splatana though. <laughs> Splatana good, man. Latana is definitely my favorite new weapon. Especially the Stamper. The Stamper is like really good. Honestly, their cries of pain are kind of sad. <laughs> what are you doing? What is this brush doing literally every time? Nope, 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 nope.
Nope. Nope. It's fine. Oh, the pain. That sucks. We've killed each other. Like, I just feel, I, I feel bad for killing my own people. Like, that's, that's how I feel right now. I hate this. Like, I know they're infected by the fuzz, but still. It still makes me sad. I want to see rival inklings in the DLC. It's only fair. I could see that happening. That'd be kind of cool. You know, like like Splatoon 2 had the Acto expansion. We could have like the inkling expansion. <laughs> um, okay, so I need to take a quick break. It's been about an hour of the stream. I want to take a quick break and use the restroom real fast and get some more water. I'm running out of water, so. That's what I'm going to do, and then we'll continue on into World 6. Let's keep it going. I shall return in a moment. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, a triple. Very cool. <clears throat> um, so before we continue, I wanted to talk about the schedule this week. So we're going to do that. I would like to share with you the schedule. Man, ever since I updated my schedule to be a square, it doesn't fit on the screen very well. There it is. Ba -da, ba -da. Things are happening soon. Breath of the Wild is tomorrow. I'm going to continue Breath of the Wild tomorrow at 8 p.m. And then Twilight Princess uh, also at 8 p.m. on Friday. And then we're going to do more Breath of the Wild because I'm really eager to get deep into that game. And I'll only do that if I play it more than once a week. So we're doing that. Uh, and then, of course, we're ending off the week on Banjo Kazooie Crowd Control, which I didn't do this past Sunday because I was hanging out with friends instead. So it'll have been two weeks since Banjo Kazooie Crowd Control, which is fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's going to be a fun time. Uh, another thing is, too, uh, a call to action to any artists in the community. Uh, we have an art theme right now for the month of January it's coming up and probably I would say during the Sunday stream I may show off art during Sunday stream um, so yeah perfect timing trill uh, the theme is bunnies rabbits anything rabbit related uh, because it is the year of the rabbit this year so that's what we're doing uh, I'll join over on the Discord, post your art in the art channel, and Trill will pin them, and I will look at them on the weekend. If you're an artist, please come out. Do it. Please post your bunnies. Or any other art that you have. I accept memes. We haven't had many memes lately. We lost all of our memers. I don't know what happened to the memers, but they disappeared. 
I hope I don't accidentally miss the deadline again. Well, the deadline is probably Sunday. Make an art, Swishy Chicken. Also, hi, Swishy Chicken. The memes are dead. I can't believe the memes are dead. I'm still here. I just haven't latched on to any memes, and I'm sorry. Crap. All right, let's get back into it. Moving forward. Hold on, I just want to double check on my map real quick. I want to make sure. Okay, so that first area, right? That's the first area there, right? Or am I crazy? Oh, no, the first area is up there. Did I miss a... Oh, there's a secret. Hold on, I got to go back. I'm going to get the secret. How do I go back? Oh, this one. I'm, I'm freaking out. Guys, I'm freaking out. <laughs> stop me. Somebody stop me. There's a secret here. Unless it counts this. Does it count the balloon? I think it might count the balloon. Which I, I don't want to do until I clear some more space. Yeah, it probably counts the balloon. We'll come back. Got some extra power uh, power eggs for you, courtesy of the captain. Thank you. I appreciate you. Epic. Yeah, the balloon takes around the, the whole area, so I want to kind of clear out the area before I do that. <gasps> yes! Hold on, I think I can upgrade now. Yes! Yes! Upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Give me that shit. Give me that good shit. Give me that better sensor. Give me that suit recovery. Mmm. Delicious. Okay, I need five more, though. And I don't know how there's going to be five more of them in this area, but I guess there will be. I already got it. Shut up. <laughs> Here, go, go help. Go put yourself to use, my child. Uh, left or right, chat? You get three from the boss, so two more in the overworld. Oh, okay, cool. I forgot that the boss gives three. You're right, though. Left or right? L or R? One or two? One, two, one, two, one, two. One. Backwards? Okay, here we go. Listening to Paul. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> In the water. Very helpful. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, that goes up to a like a special secret up here. Oh, there's a there's actually a, a mission up here. Yo. Oh wait, no, I wanted to get off! I was trying to get off! I was just trying to get off. My last Sardinium was in World 5, and it absolutely made, absolutely made me feel like an idiot because I swore I had checked where it was. Oh, wild. Yeah, some of the secrets are well hidden. And the fact that it doesn't give you the percentage in-game, you have to actually go to the app, the Nintendo Switch app, in order to see what percentage you've gotten from the, the world makes it all especially harder if you don't use that app to know whether or not you've completed an area. Conserve ink... Conserve ink splat sustainability. Jesus. I don't know why that didn't process my brain. Yeah, you do get locker stickers based on the map. There's a lot of cool stickers that you get from the campaign, actually. I, ha I need to go and update my locker at some point. My locker... I never updated my locker after I got the biggest locker. So it's there's this whole like bunch of space at the top of the locker. Oh, that's right. We're not supposed to run out of ink, huh? So, like, I need to be careful. Do I get ink refills? Mm. 
No, I do not. Well, then we're just gonna run. We're not gonna do anything crazy. Hopefully I don't need like a bunch of ink. Only a quarter of a tank left. Yeah, I've already wasted a ton of ink. Where be the end? Dodge and weave, dodge and weave. Serpentine, serpentine. It's working. It's working. Goal. 16 months, where the hell did the time go, right? Oh my God, these guys are just, wow. Oh, Jesus. Oh my God, what, what? No, 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 no. It's fine, it's fine, Upp uppies, okay. Woo, save that. All right, I did it. Give me those free inks. Holy spoly. Holy spinoli. It's possible to complete that entire stage without spending ink, except at the end. Yeah. Well, no. I mean, yeah, I could see how that would work. How does one get up there? How, how does one get up there? <laughs> Not like that. There's probably like another thing that attaches. All right, let's go get this one first though. Get off, there we go. Oh wait, that probably goes there, right? Yeah. There was only one weapon for that last one, right? Yes. That sinking feeling. Reach the goal quickly. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, you get special dialogue at the end of that one if you only shoot the end thing? Shoot a single shot at the end? That's cool. Splushomatic. First bomb. All right, here we go. This one is stressful. Well, then I guess I'll have to do it first try. Ah. 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 Oh, God. I see why. Oh, it slides! Motherfucker. <laughs> Eggs? Who needs them? Not important. Speed. Speed is of the essence. I am speed. No. 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 I hated that. And I hate that I'm going to have to do it with two other weapons that are not going to help me at all. Do it quickly or die. Oh yeah, that sinking feeling. I guess that's why it's called that. Doing this with a roller though? Ugh. Jesus. Okay, here we go. Want a tip that'll make it less stressful? Use my burst bombs. Oh, 
Oh, this is gonna be easy, actually. This isn't the slow, the slow roller. You know, famous last words, though. This is gonna be so easy, you guys. Do you even know how easy this is gonna be? Up, oh, uppies. Uppies. Uppies! <laughs> oh no! Oh, I forgot. Oh. Dang, dude. The platforms don't actually start sinking until you start standing on them. Yeah. Okay. Mistakes were almost made. The thing is, I'm not really running out of ink. That's not been an issue. So I'm just going to go. But it's good to know that you can kind of, like, take a breather if you need to on the wall. Like this. That was spicy. Yo, you got a McFlurry? What kind? Got that Oreo McFlurry? Mmm. Got that M&M McFlurry? I like the M&M one. Even though, like, it blends into, like, a brown mess of a thing. All the colors <laughs> run into the, into the ice cream. Oreo extra cookies. You can order extra cookies. I never even thought to ask for extra cookies. Well, at least he gave me the one that charges quickly. Oop, oh, oh. Almost fucked for that. The block sliding is like the worst. It always feels like it's about to push me off. Oh, almost didn't make it. Awesome. This has been a really good year for games, to be honest. You talking about like 2022? Because we're only a month into 2023. <laughs> Unless you mean 2023 has been a great year for games already. I'm excited to see whatever the next Nintendo Direct is going to be. I feel like it's been a, a hot minute since the last Nintendo Direct, and we're probably going to get one in February, I'd guess, right? Don't they usually do one in February? I mean, who knows? They, they can do whatever they want. 
And also, I feel as though it's going to be a pretty light year for the Switch. Lore. Oh my god. Operation Little Judd's Judgy Judgment. Praise behavior. Analyzing praise fur quality. No imperfections found. I guess I'll just go after the toe beans. <laughs> yes! Judd. Adorable. Pokemon Direct in February. I'd say March for Nintendo, probably. Pokemon Direct? For what? Haven't they done enough Pokemon? You know what? I, I, I hereby announce the cancellation of Pokemon. We're canceling Pokemon. Pokemon Day? Who cares? Too much Pokemon. I'm over it. <laughs> DLC? I don't want DLC. I want them to fix the game. <laughs> I don't want DLC. Fuck that shit. I didn't buy the DLC for Sword and Shield. I probably won't buy the DLC for Scarlet and Violet. I'm not better. You're better. Arceus 2. Electric Boogaloo. All right, chat. One second. I'll be right back. I just got to do something real quick. I have, to, I have to pee again. This is what happens when I drink so much water. All right. Let's go to Johto. They're never going to do another Let's Go game. But I would love that. I would love a Let's Go in Johto. All right. Breathe in, guys. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Time your movements carefully to reach the goal. I mean, time my movements carefully. What, just wait for the level to do a thing? Is that all? I see. I could see this being very difficult if you rush it. So I won't. Ooh. That got away from me very fast. It's actually easier if you breathe. <laughs> it's actually easier if you breathe along with it. It's kind of brilliant. We talked about GoldenEye briefly. I'm honestly not that into GoldenEye, to be honest with you. I know everybody loves that game, and it's like a classic to a lot of people. It's just not something that I really played a lot when I was a kid, and I still have never played a lot of it. So maybe this is a good chance to try it again. Like, I'm not opposed to it. And I definitely played, like, a chunk of it when I was a kid. Some of the campaign. I never really played multiplayer, but... You know what's really funny? Something that's so, that I find so funny is that my, my cousin was not allowed to play Pokemon because Pokemon is the devil. But he was allowed to play... James Bond 007, GoldenEye 007. The game where you shoot and kill people. Hilarious. I was allowed to play Pokemon because my parents aren't dumb, but <laughs> my parents are, aren't, aren't dumb. Aren't. Oh, dude. Oh, I got caught in the in the ink hole, bro. You're cleansing them for the Lord. <laughs> cleansing them for the Lord. I got I got stuck in the ink hole. You guys.
And now I'm starting to rush. I feel it in my bones. Yeah, we're talking about inky holes. It happens. Oh my god. I should breathe more. Don't pass out, yeah. Man, I have a problem with breathing. I have, I have issues with breathing. Sometimes I legitimately forget to breathe. Like, and I'm sure that like, that, and I'm sure that I'm still breathing, right? Like, oh God, otherwise I would die. But it's not like good breathing. I have to frequently remind myself to breathe. It's not good. I know, I need to go slow. <laughs> he says it's he tries to go faster. Gosh, this must be an infuriating speedrun level. going oh what over there oh wow brilliant the game was like <laughs> let me help you boo I almost walked off the side <laughs> 30 seconds this must be such a fun game to speedrun, though. <laughs> Wasn't there an interview with the Pope where he said Pokemon was okay because it taught kids the value of friendship and working together? Well, here's the thing. I don't know how the Pokemon is the Pokemon being the devil is the like started. I assume it has something to do with the fact that the Pokemon evolve. I think that's mainly it. It's called evolution in the Pokemon game. And so, you know, that all they all, all it takes is one word for like evangelicalists. Christian to latch on to. <laughs> and it's like, it's not even evolution like how we talk about in the science. It's not that. <laughs> it's more like a metamorphosis than anyway. Like a, like a, like a butterfly. People be crazy, man. The shit people get mad about is fucking nuts. Just saying. I don't have I don't have the same range anymore. <laughs> oh yeah, I can I can throw a small fry. My boy, my son. I can send my son to kill them. Go, my son. He's having issues now, though. There we go. Up! 
No! <laughs> I tried to go back. See, I grew up in a Christian household, but I wasn't the only thing that I wasn't allowed to play was Zelda at first. And that's mainly because my parents didn't know what the hell it was. And also probably using it as an excuse to not have to buy me new games. <laughs> I am rushing again, but I'm eager. I'm an eager beaver. My beaver is eager. Hi, Gab. Welcome in. I can't. I can't. <laughs> End him. End his life. How goes the inking? It goes pretty good, actually. We're making good progress, I think. My son fell into the void. Your son is a pretty good murderer. Thank you. Like father, like son. <laughs> you raised him well. Thank you. I'm a proud papa. The Tri-Stringer is super cool. I love the new weapons they added. I wish they added more new weapons. I do. But I'm glad that they decided to, like, kind of balance everything a little bit better instead of adding, like, a shit ton of new weapons that would make the balancing a lot harder. And also, they'll add more. I literally have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Mammy Jep, I want McDonald's. Shut up. <laughs> Go to sleep. <laughs> No McDonald's. 
You're all banned from McDonald's. <gasps> That's a real squid. Seems like these are instructions on how to mummify an inkling. Maybe in olden times, inklings thought if they preserved their bodies after death, they could be revived someday? But that's, well, there's no way this is a real one stuck here, right? No, of course not. Of course it isn't, right? Whoa. It's a real squid! Dude. It's a turn off the screens time for me, and I guess I have to listen to what he says. So, night. Uh, yeah. Have a good one, Trill. Bye. Have a good one. Sleep tight. Play your Game Boy under the covers. That's the that's the secret hack. Are there more? Wait, hold on. There's not more weapons in there, right? That was the last one. Yes. So far, so good. But that's a screen? Mm, yeah, but it's a hidden screen that no one knows about <laughs> but you. Anyway, good night, Drill. My eyes know? Trail rules are meant to be broken. <laughs> Don't listen to me, I'm a bad influence. The enemy ink is lava. Reach the goal without touching enemy ink at all. Yeah, there you go, Trill. Get a projector. This sounds awful. At least I only have to do it one time, but only get curling bombs. Don't touch enemy ink at all. And I have limited ink, question mark? Oh, but I get refills. Oh, I see what they want. This is like Puzzle Town. We're in Puzzle Town now. Oh, I touched it. Wow. Oh, no. I also only get... Is that 10 minutes? That seems like a long time. Oh, fuck this. Oh, I just also wasted my thing. I have no ink. Oh, no. Wait, what do I do? Oh, shit. Hold on. No, I can still do this. Watch me. Watch me whip. Watch me nay-nay. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, no. Jump! Oh, I made it! Let's go! <laughs> oh, dude. How do how how does this work? Okay, that's fine. I can do that. Where am I even going here? What am I? Where, where's my goal? What's what's my goal at? Oh, it's over here. Well, close enough. Well, now they got this, these fuckers. Here, I'm gonna go around the outside, around the outside, because that seems easier than going through the middle for extra eggs that I don't really need. <gasps> No. Nope. No, I can still do it. 
Oh, I touched it! Wait, I touched the ink. I absolutely did. You saw that. Free, dude. It's free. I, I, I absolutely touched the ink. What? <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Whoa. <laughs> okay, at least I only have to do that one time, though. That's nice. Onwards. Or backwards. Onwards to backwards. Will you find secret? Oh, hell yeah. What do we got? Well, that's a cool lantern. What do we got next? Torture Tour. Fight your way to the goal. Torture Tour? What kind of name is that? <laughs> kinky. Oh, no. Torture Tour. That's what the Kinky College does. They go on Torture Tour. <laughs> None of this limited ink bullshit. We're killing motherfuckers up in this piece. Murder! My favorite pastime. <laughs> Pogo man! Oh, I gotta forgot about the Pogo guys. They're so stupid. Jesus. Secret? Is that a secret? Or is that where I'm going? No, I guess that's where I'm going. Downward. Stamp man. What's up, dude? Oh, you're so happy and squeaky. Bye. See ya. That was a terrible use of that Trizuka. Found the name of this level kind of misleading. I think it's just like, I don't know. You're just going on a murderous rampage. I think that's what it is. They should have just called it Murder Road or something. Murder Madness.
Why do you keep dropping off? Just stay up there. Oh, shit. <laughs> the, the, the bomb keeps falling off the side somehow. Even though it's landing directly at his feet. It's like he's pushing it off. Like a cat knocking something off a shelf. Yo, it's KB back at it again with the, uh, the gift sub to, to Purple Pixel. Love that. Thank you. I keep thinking I have small fry and then I throw a bomb. Ice. And Relic. Let's get it going. Thank you. It's very kind of you, sir. Please, no, exit this this mortal plane. Please exit this mortal plane. Thank you. Let's go, Yes, you can steal that. <laughs> Please exit this mortal plane. I just, it's been something I've been saying a lot, and I don't know where I got it from. I don't think I got it from anywhere. I think I've just been saying that. <laughs> exit this mortal plane, you heathen. You absolute degenerate. Ow! Owie! Owies! No! <laughs> what would be a dope Dragon Ball Z related Twitch name? Ooh. Um. A Banjo Kazooie speedrunner named Freeziza. You are getting on my one last nerve. No! <laughs> The mortal play no longer requires your existence. <laughs> the mortal play no longer requires your existence. Please exit this door.
going to wait right here. Whoa, where did you come from? Oh, my God. I didn't even activate the other guys. They're just chilling over there. Look at them. Look at them. New record. Let's go. New record. I'm a speedrunner, motherfuckers. Progress has been made. Progress. Uh, I want to go back down there. Because I could progress further upwards, but that's kind of like the end goal times. So we're just going to jump off the side of the building. <gasps> I can fix this. I can fix this. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Nobody saw. <laughs> I thought I could jump midair. I might have been able to make it if I had enough time. That's funny. Oh, sorry, I'm still laughing about that. <laughs> that death. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's the funniest thing to happen tonight. <laughs> oh, shit. It looks like there's more secrets here. There's probably one up here somewhere. Wait, no, I already got one up there. Oh! Surprise! Surprise, you got a server. <laughs> Thanks. Is there like one off the side somewhere? 
I'm gonna count this. Nope. All right, keep it rolling. We got only rollers. I'm starting to run low on water again, so I'm going to go get some more water real quick. Um, actually, you know what? We're almost at two hours of stream. We can probably do a stand break before we keep it rolling. Let's do it. Let's all, everybody stand up and stretch. Ooh, good stretch. All right, I'll be back. <laughs>What is a stand? What does that mean? I've heard this term before. No, but somebody said it the other day in a different context. Oh, it's a JoJo thing. Stands the power system in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Yeah, I know nothing about JoJo. So now I understand. I'm glad. I'm glad that I understand. Is that a freaking JoJo reference? <laughs> Thank you for informing me, chat. I don't fully understand. <laughs> but I, I stand... Under, though? I don't know about under. <laughs> Welcome back. Stands have a variety of wild powers. So I've heard. Me and Brooke should probably watch JoJo's Bizarre Adventure at some point. Probably. I don't think Brooke has seen it either. We're both very uninformed. Eh, I mean, I I heard it's like mi a mixed bag. To be honest. So, like, I'm not hurting for it. But also, people reference it all the time. And then there's the meme that everything's a JoJo reference. There are, gr are, there are some gruesome scenes. Bro, we've been watching Chainsaw Man. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Gore is fine. I mean, is it worse than Chainsaw Man? Chainsaw Man's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. When Brooke was like, oh, it's pretty gory. You can be okay with that. It's like, yeah, it's fine. I don't mind gore. I mean, I kind of do a little bit, but like that's part of the fun of gore, isn't it? Gotta go, friends. Uh, friends want to have a game night, so good night and good luck finishing this story with Splatoon 3. Thank you, KB. Thank you for all the gift subs and everything tonight. You are incredible. Thank you very much. I appreciate your support, my dude. Seriously. Have a great night. Enjoy your, your time with friends. Alrighty. All right, dear friends. Shall we keep it rolling? <laughs> Let's go. They see me rolling. They rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling down the river. So like the goal is just keep on rolling. I mean, that's the name of the thing. So like, I assume I can just go. Do I have unlimited ink? I have unlimited ink. Oh no, I don't. I just have a lot of ink. I mean, this isn't like timed or anything, is it? Whoa! Bounce! Ooh, nice. 
Oh, that bounce is so satisfying. I wish they would use this bounce mechanic a little bit more. In, like, the multiplayer and stuff. That would be kind of neat, right? You don't see the bounce pads in multiplayer very often. They had them in, like, the shifty stations in Splatoon 2. Hi, Shaf. This music is so triumphant. It sounds like a Christmas jubilee. <laughs> well, not that part. Not the part with the, the horns. Surprise, motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> Some fries, motherfucker. That's true, Asan. But horns can also be Christmassy. You can have Christmas horns. <laughs> yeah, I missed the Shifty Station stages too. I actually didn't really care for most of them, but some of them were really well done. And I'd love to see them make a return in Splatoon 3. <laughs> A stage creator! That's what I'm saying! That's what I'm saying. We gotta have that. We gotta have. That would be so cool. That seems like a Splatoon 4 kind of thing, though. If they were to do anything like that. I'd love for them to do that, though. Like, could you imagine if that, that's what the DLC was? Is custom stages? And you get all the, like, the shifty station bits and, like, all the stuff from the single player and all the bouncy pads and blocks, blocks and shit. Like, it wouldn't be that difficult to put together either. There have been plenty of console map makers that have just been really good, like Forge Mode and Halo. Forge Mode and Halo, if you just had a, for like, literally the exact same concept, but for Splatoon, it would work. Like, the whole level, all the levels are made out of these blocks and stuff anyway. Like, it wouldn't be hard. And then, yeah, and then they could do, like, they could do, like, contests or something to, like, pick the best stages for, for a Splatfest or something. Could you imagine? And, like, playing other people's stages? Like, custom games and stuff? They'd have to expand the custom, like, the private lobbies a little bit, but... Doing custom games with just, like, random stages that you find online is so fun in Halo. It's one of the things that I miss in gaming in general, and something that is unmatched by anything other than Halo. And I'm talking, like, Halo 3 and Reach, not Halo 4, 5, and crap, crap stick. Halo shit stick. The new one. Yeah, like specials only matches or like whatever. Like, yeah, you could have all kinds of like cool rule sets. It'd be really sick. All right, cool. That was not too bad. That that stage was pretty, uh, uh, a, a walk in the park. A breezy, warm summer day in the park. That, that one. Pretty satisfied. Get rid of this goo. Thank you. Thanks, Lazuli. Appreciate it. <gasps> lore, 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 lore. After leaping from Inkopolis Square to the world stage, Off the Hook has found their new side project, forming, performing vocals for a rising rock band. Wait, performing vocals for a rising rock band as damp socks feet off the hook. Uh... Discovered online, their super talented collaborators offer an upbeat, melancholy sound that had OTH hooked, OTH hooked, OT. I don't understand what that means. <laughs> oh, off the hook, OTH off the hook. That's that had okay. That had off the hook hooked. Okay. Gotcha. 
I was like, what is that supposed to mean for a second there? My brain did not process that. Thank you. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> I had a weird dream once where I was... Uh, welcome back, Trill. Uh, I had a weird dream once where I was watching a Sploon stream... But somehow partnered with crowd. Con it was somehow partnered with crowd control, and viewers could add in obstacles as the streamer went through this long spoon map. There was like a visual interface and everything. You can make walls, empty, empty bomb, enemy bombs. Jesus, I can read. Enemies, ink uninkable terrain, all kinds of stuff, and it was really cool. Okay, good night again. Bye, <laughs> bye, trail. Hey, that's a cool dream though. And also, I think that would be pretty sick. Also, it sounds like you were listening. Were you listening? No screens, but you listen. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Rules are meant to be broken. I am podcast. I am the embodiment of podcast. I type with eyes closed. I mean, who's going to know? Who's going to know? If you got headphones in, and you're all under the covers and it's dark. And you're just listening. Who's gonna know? Dive and dash. All right, here we go. And I get to use my very favorite weapon in this whole game. I love the arrow spray. I liked the arrow spray a lot in Splatoon 2, but I love it even more in Splatoon 3. I, I, I grappled onto it immediately. Reach the goal within the time limit. Here we go. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I realized almost a little too late what I was meant to do there. This is fun. What a neat level idea. Any levels that require, like, precise movement are fun. I'm a fan of precise movement. Oh, where are they going? Where are they going? <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny to me. Oh, I went the long way. The long way without bonus eggs. Jump! Oh, no! Okay. We can cut corners. It's fine. That's fine. It's a Sonic level. Honestly, it's better than a Sonic level. <laughs> I'd love to see Sonic make levels like that. I guess they do. I'm just I'm just ragging on Sonic again. <laughs> uh, okay, so I went up there. Let's take a look around for some secrets. There was a secret way back at the beginning, and I think it was the balloon. I think we might have enough shit moved to to do the balloon now. So we're gonna do that. Making fun of Sonic is fun. And I feel as though I've played enough Sonic games to warrant being able to make fun of it. Like, I'm not a Sonic fan, but honestly, if I was a Sonic fan, I'd probably still make fun of it. <laughs> yeah. 
Wow, this really taking me on a, on a journey. I have not been up here yet. That's problematic. I think this is probably the last piece of lore, if that's what this is. The last piece of that book. Yeah, float down to me, my lore. We've got them all. We've got them all. Subject name Marigold. Oh my god. Nishiyo Oranda. Anarchy District. Three three dash. Poison 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 rogue alias. Wow. So this Marigold is like a, a like a undercover fucking person. Scary. What does that mean? <laughs> or cloned? No. It seemed well maybe. <laughs> I guess there's a lot of those 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 fish around. They all kind of look the same. The marigold fish there. Are they all called marigold? <laughs> there's a balloon down there. How get? How get? It move. How get? Balloon? Where'd it go? Do it come back? Bye. <laughs> bye bye. It's just going around in a circle. Okay, did I get all the ones down there? I think, where, where's the other one? The, the platformer that I didn't go to yet. It, it ain't this. This is up. Gotta swap to the hero charger. How do I do that? Can I just do that at any time? Oh. I believed you. <laughs> Hassan, I believed you. That's true. I guess there isn't a bunch of hero weapons in this one. It's just the one. Secrets. Yum. Delish. Don't tease with the keys. Babe! Don't tease with the keys! I'm sorry. Find the keys and unlock the path to the goal. Oh, look at these nerds. Whoa, look at them skid around. Whoa! I'm sorry, is this an open world platformer collectathon level? Mmm, yes, I think it is. That's what I'm calling it. I want to kill one of you, but you're all the way over there. I hope none of the keys are like inside their bodies. How the fuck? Oh, they are inside the bodies.
Oh, where did that fucker go? Let me can't use. Why, because I have too many? Out. But I thought it just got rid of the old ones. There we go. Oh, he didn't even have a key. Rude. Yeah, mines. I kind of figured that out pretty quick. Mines. Or I could just shoot him. I could just shoot him. Yeah, look at that skill. That's all it takes. How many keys do I need? Three? Four? I guess maybe one for each one guy. No, well, one of them had eggs inside, so. So I'm guessing that guy also has eggs. <laughs> We're fighting now. Ah, shit. Where'd he go? Oh my god. All right, here. I wish, I wish, can you not get rid of the mines though? I thought you could. Okay, that's fine. Like, it won't let me place any more mines. Oh, never mind. That's fuck. I'm sorry. I'm st I'm just dumb. Just don't mind me. I'm dumb. Got it. No. Fine. I'll tell you. I was pushing the wrong button. <laughs> I wasn't going to say <laughs> because I'm embarrassed. <laughs> I was very confused about why the button wasn't working. I was pressing the special button. Yeah. Which is, you know, like it's a good combination. It's like, a, it's, you know, whatever. I've only put hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of hours into this game. <laughs> All right. Now we're just going to do it two more times. Although, I think it's going to be easier maybe with a sniper. We shall see. Because this is more aiming related than anything else. Of course, they run away immediately. Oh, this one's got the scope. I'm not a fan of the scope. Yeah, totally easier. Like, watch this shit. Oh, wait, he went away. As soon as I looked in his direction. Sir? Oh, I missed. This is certainly more fun than trying to use mines, though. Man. <laughs> I don't know anybody who uses a scoped charger in, in, in multiplayer. I literally don't know how you could, you could do this. Man, these, these little fuckers are smart. They know when I'm looking at them. Where'd he go? Whoa! Back here, you little fucker. Oh, you're the one with the eggs, that's right. 
I actually forgot that. No, do I hit him though? Of course, it had to be the one with the eggs. Shaft. I've never used I've never used a scope. I mean I barely use splat chargers anyway. To be honest. Or e-leaders or anything like that. But the fact of the matter is, I should probably use them more often so I can get used to them. <laughs> So it's were good in Splatoon 1, but lost their usefulness from 2 onwards. Yeah, I don't know anybody who uses them. All right, now I have to do it, but with a tub. I want to like chargers. I really want to like chargers. Because I like sm snipers in other games, but I don't know. I'm much more of an aggressive, up-close play style in this game than I am in, like, something like Call of Duty or whatever. Oh, it's the Blob Lobber. It's the Blob Lobber. This is going to be an interesting challenge, actually. little game of cat and mouse there. Oh, let's go! <laughs> yeah, that's the fastest time yet. I think the Blob Lover was honestly the easiest one to use for that. Even though it, they think it's the hardest one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm much more of like a front lines, like in your face kind of player. I definitely like to get up close and personal with my enemy. <laughs> Going for speed, baby. Don't tease. Don't tease me. Imagine they add a melee weapon to Splatoon. I mean, they kind of, I mean, kind, I mean, the brushes and the, and the, the rollers and the Splatana are kind of melee weapons, but they're all, like, they also have long range shots as well, but I would consider those to be, like, melee weapons-ish. Even though Splatanas are, like, one of the longest range weapons in the game. That's true. Brush is definitely a melee weapon. Splatana is based on a we melee weapon, but it does fire shots. So let's be clear about that. Stamp. Yeah, smacking people with a stamp. Speaking of stamp. <laughs> Wait, what? Hold on, one of them is the stamp, and one of them you do it with nothing.
Please make use of the compliment. Oh, you get canned specials. Oh. Oh. Okay. Stamp enemies within the time limit. Oh, this is like practice zone to make sure you know how to use the stamp. How do I throw the stamp? There we go. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Are they in bowling balls? What the crap is going on here? I could see this being very difficult without the stamp. One remaining. Where? Varek! Welcome in, dude. Finally caught you live. Glad to have you in chat, bud, my dude. Okay, well, how the fuck are you gonna do that without the stamp? <laughs> to be honest with you, I don't know how I'm gonna do that without the stamp. I mean, I know they're gonna give me specials, but. Yo, what's up, Jarzus? I've been good. I've been doing really good. Just kind of chill axing tonight. Oh, I'm gonna do it with the stamp, except that they're gonna give me limited stamps, is what it is. That's exactly it. What? Jesus Christ. Struggle bus for a second there. Oh, this is not going to be that much different, to be honest with you. Oh, I wish I got both of them. It's bad. I'm thinking about it too much. I need to pay attention to when my special is going to run out when I need to do. Oh, geez. Dude,
Oops. Alida Las Vegas. What's up? How's it going, Alida? Sorry, I am focus mode at the moment because this is a bitch. This is this 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 is this is treating me bad. One sec. Welcome in, guys. Oh no, I don't miss. Is this the one? No, oh, it didn't come out of the hole in time. It didn't come out of the hole in time. I should have given it like a second for it to come out the hole. <laughs> anyway, hi Alita and friends, welcome in. I am Josh Jepson. I am here playing Splatoon 3 Story Mode. We're actually towards the end of the game now. Getting pretty close. Uh, and it's been a good time tonight, so I'm glad you guys are here. Please uh, please hang out with us. Uh, follow the channel if you're brand new here. Love to see new people show up in chat. You guys are awesome. How was your stream, Alita? What were you streaming? Did we get a shout out command for, for Alita? We did, didn't we? It says what you're playing. Use your words. I don't even know what that is. Use your words. Is that the one that, uh, is that the one that's like Jackbox, but not? It's got a Jackbox feel to it. Gotcha. Unique in its own way. Gotcha. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, I've heard of it then. I have not played it. Very vice of you. Thanks. Is that the one the with lyrics guy made? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Brental Floss? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're right. It's all coming back to me now. It's flowing in. Hugs for the Jeppy Man. Thanks, Gab. Co-created by ben Brental Floss. Yeah, and his Canadian friend or something. Just be warned. I've been compared to Chugga for my puns. Bring it on! <laughs> I'll groan along with the rest of them. <laughs> I'll give you the big groan. Ugh. I don't know. I like puns. I'll laugh. All right. Well, I was very close to getting this. So. Try spamming the throw with the ultra stamp. It lets you hit the balls from further away and spend less time trying to catch up to them. I mean, just like for every ball, though, maybe. Oh, it goes through multiple. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. OK, no, that's OK. I get it. I understand. I, I thought it was going to hit one and then explode and then be done. That's what I thought. Okay, this is way easier. This is infinitely easier. Oh shit. I say as I immediately screw it up. Oh, of course. Okay, I mean, I need to practice a little bit more and get the hang of this new strat. Um, but that's way easier. Yeah, you can throw the hammer. Uh, I'm, I'm doing this very slowly, to be honest with you. 
This is not my best work. How far can I throw the hammer even? Pretty far, actually. Alright, that's that was a really fantastic tip, Asan. <laughs> Wow, beautiful. All right, we're moving up in the world. <laughs> we're moving up in the world, baby. Look at how much progress I made. Guys, I'm also going through and getting, doing every level with every weapon, by the way. So look at this. It just feels so satisfying to have all those check marks, you know? I'm very, I'm very happy. <gasps> look, look, I can get it. I got it. Um, hold on, hold on. I think I only have two more levels left. I mean, I gotta get the rest of the secrets before I finish it, but I think I just have this level and then the boss. Oh, shit, son. Think you're gonna like the boss? I think I'm gonna like the boss, too. I've liked all the boss bosses so far. Yeah, I think I got them all. Oh, wait, never mind. I lied. There's another one down there. Okay, so three more levels. Okay, well, let's go do that one first. Are we breaking before the boss? I'm probably gonna break sooner than the boss. I might take another break, like very soon. I actually need to use the restroom again because I've drink. I've had so much goddamn water today. But I'm gonna get a few more of the secrets first, and then we'll take a break. Fly fishing. That sounds fun, actually. Uh, yeah. So let me let me. Oh, I can't look at my map while I'm on the grindy pole. While I'm grinding the pole, you know. Um, I actually have almost everything already. Yeah, it's just up there that I need to cover, and then there's a couple of secrets here. Somewhere. Had pasta for dinner. Yum. What kind of pasta? That's This is an important question. Pasta, different pastas taste very different to me. It's a texture thing, you know? Did you actually open up the kettle up top there? No, I didn't. Does that count towards it? Okay, I opened it up. Okay, I'm gonna go up there real quick. I'm not gonna go in it, but. Oh God, it rumbles the closer I get. Scary. Okay, so I believe that is every inch of the map touched, at least. But there's still secrets here. Oh, one of them's probably down there. Find it, my friend. My son! Look deep within your soul. Sniff. Sniff it. Sniff it out, my friend. Why does he not do it? I don't know. I'll find it myself then. You lazy bitch. It'll say 100% on the map. It actually doesn't... It doesn't... I don't think it actually tells you 100% on here. It only says it on... Um, yeah, see, it doesn't, it doesn't actually say 100%. It says it on the app, but not on here. But also, I still have these green areas to touch, so I need to find the secret hidden thing here, wherever it may be. 
<laughs> Unless there isn't one. Small fry, find it. Go, my minion. I'm in it. It's here somewhere. Yeah, sometimes he needs a little shuffling around, and sometimes he just doesn't fucking do anything at all. It's really annoying. This is the this is the le my least favorite part of the game right here is small fry just not doing anything. No, it's not on top of the building I'm standing next to because that's the middle part part. So you can see like like the green is only on the side. It's not in the middle. Or I guess it is. This whole area is green. Never mind. I was looking at the contrast of it. No, you're totally right. It might just be on the other side. Maybe if you open the boss kettle. Mm, no, because I don't think that it would flash. I don't. Th I think it only flashes green for secrets only. But I'm not 100% sure about that. Okay, which side? Okay, so it's over here, like down? It's probably down here somewhere. Find it! Find it! <laughs> Jesus! I know it's here. I know it's here somewhere. Why won't you find it? I mean, maybe it is up on top of the building somewhere. Oh, uh, okay. Well. Pretty sure I know which one he's missing. If you know, feel free to be like, it's there. He keeps going over here. <laughs> up on top of the ledge that's halfway up the level you haven't done. Up to halfway up to the level you haven't done. Okay. Okay, I know what you're talking about. Let's go. I gotta get back up there though. It's the fastest, easiest way to get up there. This way. Oh wait, I can't go up that way. Never mind. Hold on. Just keep going this way then. I get, wait, I can warp. I can warp. No, I can't. I don't have a warp up there. <clears throat> I mean, I can warp to that one and then go up, but I'm I'm all right. No, I don't have one up there. Both of these levels I haven't done yet. Oh, you can jump to a gray level? I thought you couldn't jump to it unless you've beaten it. Oops. <laughs> oh well. So halfway up. So it's on this platform somewhere. Oh, I looked here too. I must have been like inches away, centimeters away from it. Is that it? Oh, there is more though. There's probably another one up up top here. Yeah, there's more. And it's likely up here, but it also could be down there somewhere. That might be the boss kettle now. Well, we'll come back to it later. All right. Whoops. <laughs> I need to take a break real quick soon. Actually, let's do one more level and then we'll take a break. Down. Down, go down. Oh my god. I'm trying to go down. Not that far down. <laughs> I'm going to go do this level. <laughs> Fly fishing. Here we go. 
Hi, Tornado. Splats go good. I was, I, was I was on the struggle bus for a second there, but this one just gets to use the inkjet the whole time, so that sounds like fun, actually. I love me some inkjet. Oh, hell yes. Yes, I am your overlord. Bend to my will. Oh. Oh, you can press B to get a little extra lift. I didn't read that in time. I didn't know you could do that. Can you do that in multiplayer too? What the heck? I did not know you could do that. To be fair, I don't really use any, I don't use the inkjet almost ever in multiplayer. I, none, of the, none of the classes that I use have inkjet on them. That's kind of neat. It's like a little jump. Oh God. And where there are jumps, there are fails. Oh, oh, you can do it multiple times too. That's nice. There's like a little recharge period. Yo, this is pretty legit. I like this level. <laughs> Why does this level music sound like a pinball machine? <laughs> Where are we going? Where are we going? This way. Gonna, I'm just gonna chill here for a second. Don't mind me. Oh, I, I can't even hit him that far. Oh, I see. Oh my god, there's a thing in the middle. I can't hit it that far. There we go. No! Stay on target. Stay on target. All right. So we have one more mission and then the final boss. And then I think there's some post game mission thing, but uh, don't spoil that for me because I haven't seen that yet. I don't know what that's all about. I know it's hard, but don't spoil it. So one more mission, then the boss. So I'm gonna take a quick break where we can stand up, go get a drink, uh, use the bathroom, etc. And I'll be back in a couple of minutes, and then we will finish this game. Right now. Ah! Okay, we'll be right back. Enjoy the music. I would say yes, Asan. I would say Breath of the Wild's little zoom feature where you mark on the map constantly. You can make the pillars appear. With your, with your, with your, what's it called? The Sheikah Slate zooms in. That's what I would say. Yeah, the beacon things. But not a needed use? I mean, I guess not. I'm trying to think. Is there any other thing like that in Zelda? There's the there's the hawk's eye thing in Twilight Princess, but that's not needed. Um <laughs> Way ahead of you, Vice. Um <sighs> I don't know. I don't think there is anything like that. 
<laughs> this is worrying. <laughs> I'm big now. Oh. Yeah, I don't think there's anything like that, because those are the only three things I can think of like that in Zelda. Didn't really have, like, any far-reaching, like, telescope-like item in other games. I don't think. Skyward Sword doesn't have anything like that. I got surprised by twi- oops. Oh, my microphone is floppy. Uh, asking me to be Bean Queen. Yeah, it does that now. It, there's like, every so often on Twitch, in the chat, you'll get a little pop-up that's like, you can do this with channel points. I don't know, I guess to promote channel points more. Honestly, we really don't use channel points as much as we should. I should like add sound effects to channel point redemptions. Like whenever the swear jar activates. It should, at least when the swear jar activates, it should play a sound, and the Bean Queen should play some sort of fanfare. And maybe VIP. So I'll have to set that up at some point. Oh, it happens when you reach the amount needed for a redemption. Oh, so it doesn't just happen randomly. That's interesting. So, Asan, you just have, you have 100,000 100, beans right now. I would not waste it on Bean Queen. It is actually pointless and useless. So don't don't do that. <laughs> I mean, it's not entirely pointless. You do get a special Discord roll, but also somebody can immediately take it away from you, and it's a hundred thousand beans. Truly, it was created as a way for my mods to waste their beans. <laughs> Plan on spending my VIP. Oh yeah, beans for VIP in March. Hell yeah, dude. Well, you're double. You're double the way there now. Apparently. Dude, March is gonna be the TRG Coliseum. Oh, I'm so excited for that. It's gonna be great. I'm very excited for that. I know, it's so soon. It's literally like a month and like a couple of weeks, like a month and a week away. Yeah, just about, almost. March 3rd through the 5th on Proton John's Twitch channel. A month and 10 days, yes. Very exciting, because we're all gonna be in person again for the first time since 2019. The second Coliseum was the last time that we were all together in person. And I think we really truly all will be there this time. I can't think of anybody that won't, that isn't showing up. Oh, well, I can think of one person that might not be there, but. And Brooke isn't going. She's totally allowed to and able to, but she wants to, like, spend extra time, like, working and streaming and stuff, and that's totally understandable. She just wants to, like, focus on her VTuber stuff. She's getting a new computer this week, so um, her streams are going to be popping off, so. You'll get to join it this time as well? Hell yeah. It's going to be great. I'm very excited for it. All right. After this song. Curious as to what segments are going to appear, make an appearance. Me too. <laughs> we, we've, we've had meetings about segments already. And there's a lot of ideas floating around. Both new and familiar. Um, but the schedule hasn't been finalized yet. Oh, yeah, the shirt. I, I forgot about that. Yeah, there's a shirt every year now. I wonder what this year's shirt's going to look like. My favorite was year four, the blue one. I like that one a lot. This is the sixth year. Yep, technically. That's wild that we've been doing it for six years. 
What? Yeah, we started in 2018. That's so wild. That's so wild. All right, let's um, play a video game. It is time. It is time. We are here. Uh, I am concerned about this last little secret that I don't know where it is, but we'll find it. Any segments from the community here that got tossed into the pool for Coliseum segments? Honestly, I'm not sure. Uh, I Oh, actually, yes. Yes. I submitted uh, the idea of doing a uh, another Nuts and Bolts segment. So that'll probably be, uh, be on the schedule, I, I will say. There's possibly going to be a Nuts and Bolts segment. Which, uh, which am I looking for? Uh, I don't know. Something in this area. It's up here somewhere. It could just be that. That counts. Fun fact, that counts. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, we can't go in it yet because I still have one more level to do. <laughs> but now I know. Okay, so we have to do all three weapons of these. So I have to do this level three times before the boss. So we got a little bit to go here. <laughs> Hero gear. Middle gear. Yeah, now I know. <laughs> At the end of the game, the last possible thing that I can uncover. Yes, shoot my child. Whoa. Oh, we're going down. No, no, no. The end is up there. But, sir, 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 stop this elevator. The end is... Okay. 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 <laughs> you blew the lid off that one. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, shit. Ow, 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 ow. Pain. Suffering. How do I get up there? How do I... How do I get up there? How do I get up there? What? 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 I guess they want me to shoot them on the top of these platforms. Dude! Oh, didn't mean to do that. Can I make that jump? Nada. There must be like a little pathway that I'm just not seeing. Somewhere. Oh! <clears throat> yeah, totally. My eyes are starting to dry out. <laughs> this this puzzle is very complex. <laughs> Come on, Relic. It's co obviously this puzzle is complex. Oh, I can just do that. I don't have to kill those guys. Honestly, that's not you. That level went by really fast. It doesn't. That didn't feel like a like a end game level there, but that's okay. I need to blink more often. But blinking doesn't win you the video game. <laughs> yeah, my eyes need to be hydrated. I'm going to close my eyes for a second. Got to just loot. Hold on, guys. Let me lo I got to lube up my eyes.
Y'all in chat do any speed running? Have you guys do, done any speed running before? I've been considering getting back into it, and I was going to do Start Banjo recently, but then I kind of like, I don't know, it came down to it, and I was like not in the mood for it that day, and then uh, I, have, I haven't put it back on the schedule. <laughs> I need to learn it, but I'm afraid to learn it. I don't know why. I'm afraid to learn a thing. I'm very interested in getting back in it, though. Part of me is like, maybe I should just do Sunshine again. But then, that's a bad idea. Or is it? I don't know. Mario Kart 8 DLC courses. Hell yeah. No, Mario Kart's fun to, to speed ride because it's not it's not as involved as something like a like a you know like a Ocarina of Time or Mario 64 or whatever. It's kind of like optimizing shortcuts and stuff. Did an Octo expansion any percent once for PSL side competition? And won 20 bucks. Yo, let's go. That's awesome. That's cool. Hey, welcome in, JT. Oh, yeah. Honestly, I could use this. Why not speedrun something you've never heard of and is $5 on Steam? <laughs> Honestly, Sunshine would be... Like, if I were to speedrun anything, it would be Banjo or Sunshine again. I really want to learn Banjo. I'm just afraid... It's just that the problem that I have with speedrunning is that it t if you want to be good at it, it takes so much time. And I'd rather play like a variety of games throughout the week instead of just, I'm going to stream the same game for every stream or, you know, even practice it off stream. Like, that's just so much time. Because you have, like, I mean, that's the only way to get good at anything, right? Is practice, practice, practice. And speedrunning especially is like... Going ham. Especially for a game that's like, that is well optimized, it's already been speedrun a lot. And concentration, yeah, concentration. Yeah, it's just the learning part of it that I'm like, kind of intimidated by right now. Because, like, once you get the tricks down, it's, like, it's just kind of, like, practice. And that's not too bad. It still takes a lot of time, though. But the act of learning new tricks is... I don't know. I'm scared of it right now. I don't have... I, 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 listen, I don't have enough mental energy to get through my normal day, let alone learn how to speedrun. Excuse me, sir. Perish. 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 Let me send you to the... <gasps> oh, that's bad. It restarts the whole level, too. That's an oof if I ever saw one. That's an oof. Bro, leave me alone. Right, exactly. That's kind of where I'm at. I'm just like, there's so many games, and like, there's art. Like, I already can't keep up with new releases anymore. I don't know how. I, I don't know. Is it because there are more games than there used to be, or is it? I mean, there's definitely more games than there used to be, but even like, just like mainstream, like the games that everybody's playing, like I, I can't even keep up with that shit. I used to keep up with it. I used to, you know, at least know about every game that's coming out, even if I never played it. Not every game, but most of them. 
Now I'm just like, what the fuck? There's so much to play, and that, and meanwhile, all I want to do is play Banjo Kazooie mods and Mario Mario hacks. <laughs> And Splatoon. Splatoon's the only new game that I'm keeping up with. Oh, God. Well, yeah, no, I mean, if I were to speedrun anything, I wouldn't be, like, trying to go for, like, a world record or anything like that. I would definitely just be, like, going for my own records. So. And trying to beat my PBs and stuff like that. All right. Here we go. I think I've got 100% of everything in this level. All the kettles done. Everything in this level, everything in this level. At least I think. Wow. Okay, here we go. Also, is this level called the Happiness Treehouse Lab? Happiness Research Lab. I thought I said Treehouse Lab. <laughs> Oh, no. The Obscurist. What is that? I don't even know what that word is. How would you pronounce that? Chi... Chiroscurist? Chiro... Chiroscurist? What does that mean? It's Italian? I'm not Italian! How do I do this? <laughs> Here we go. I'm so excited. Fight your way to the exit. Our captain is picking up a strong signal. It might be ex-captain Cuttlefish. It's Big Man! Hey! Hold right there. Hey, hey, hey! This treasure isn't yours. You can't have it. I wouldn't fight you if I didn't have to, but... This is for Splatsville! Bleh. Oh, he's turning green? Big man. Hype Manta Storm. Wait, Manta Storm?! It's even the same color. You're kidding! Bro, we were just talking about sunshine, too. Dude, this is amazing! What? Are you- you're kidding me! Dude, no way! Oh my god! What? Oh, what a great reference. I'm deeply in love with this. This makes me very happy. We were literally just talking about Sunshine 2. That's that's hilarious. All right, one one hit down. You're pretty good. You're damn right I'm good. But I don't lose. I've been training too hard to lose. I don't know. You look pretty soft and squishy. Wait, did everything just float away? All right, split them up. Split them up, 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 split them up, 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 split them up, up, up. Oh, he's dropping bombs on me, too. Oof. Maybe I should upgrade my hero gear first. Oh, wait, can I do that? No, I can't do that yet. My hero gear is already up. Everything's up.
Where'd he go? Oh, they like disappear too. The Manta Storm. I can't believe this. This is brilliant. You've got moves, it's true. But I've got, uh, more moves! <laughs> no more kid gloves, it's big man time. <laughs> oh, now there's like, little raised platforms. This is actually brilliant. I'm s I, I can't believe this didn't get spoiled for me, given how long it's been since I started this. I cannot believe this did not get spoiled for me. Well done. Well done, everyone, for holding your tongues. <laughs> for so long. <laughs> Honestly, like, this would have been so much less cool if I had, if it had been spoiled for me. <laughs> I'm pretty happy. All right, that's three hits. How many hits you take? Oof. Well, that was a flop. I really tried to. Ay, 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 ay. Hey, 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 did he just blow himself up? Holy shit, that's... That's brutal, dude. Wow. So glad you didn't figure out your upgraded radar tells you which one's the real one. Wait, what? My upgraded radar tells me... Oh, it, like, marks it red, doesn't it? I did see the red markers. I, I didn't realize that that was part of my radar, though. I don't know why I didn't pick up on that, but I, I did notice the red markers, and I was kind of going for that, but... Mostly, I was just shooting at any Manta that came my way. Look at this mute. Look at this mute. Grab. Oh my god, amazing. Also, that was a very easy boss. And there's definitely another boss. <laughs> There's definitely more. Uh-huh, uh-huh. The captain says, you crushed it, Agent 3. And they also had some choice things to say about Deep Cut. Wouldn't want them to be right now. Uh, wouldn't want to be them right now. You eat me? Eat me. You bet. He's an old man. Anyway. Come in, do you copy? Gramps, we read you. Not uh, exactly loud and clear, but we read you. What's up? Are you okay? What's happening where you are? Ha, ah, I finally got this dad blasted thing working again. Okay, so here's my report. I'm being held captive by someone or something calling themselves Mr. Grizz. I heard that loud and clear. As for where I am, beats me, but my left knee is aching something fierce. Which means I'm at, uh, I'm at altitude, somewhere high up. Well, that's a pretty good hint. Uh, there's only one place that fits the bill, right? Well, well. Your injured knee may have uh, betrayed this location, but don't expect any workers come. Thank you for this, by the way. I won't underestimate the legendary leader of the Squid Beak Splatoon ever again. I'll just go ahead and deal with you now, before you become an actual inconvenience. Oh, wait a minute! Hey! What's that? What, what do you think you're doing? Yeah. Huh, that didn't sound great for Gramps. Gramps, we're counting on you! Stay strong! Just as soon as we figure out how to get to wherever you are. Uh-oh. It just panned over to the rocket. Am I gonna fix the rocket with the stuff, the crap I found? Why don't you go take a closer look at it? Might just be our ticket into that rocket. I think it's pretty clear that we have to get into that rocket somehow. Are you ready to try this? Um. Um. Yeah. Yes. Hold on. Yeah, hero gear. Hold on. You're right. I do have one more upgrade. Le um. 
I do also need to use the restroom again. The excitement from that battle has uh, expedited things. I'm gonna go pee. <laughs> Man, I, shoot. I still can't believe, I still can't believe that they made an entire boss that was just a sunshine reference. That's incredible to me. What a great, what a great thing. Uh, check that you completed area six and talk to Marie for your reward. Yeah, okay, yeah, talk to Marie for my reward. Where, where's she at? I definitely completed area six, but I can double check on the app just to make sure it says 100%. I shall do. <clears throat> I mean, she wouldn't have given me those. Oh, I didn't get the one from area five until just now. <coughs> I'm just going to double check anyway. It's also going to be very satisfying to see. Yeah. Wait. Oh, it hasn't updated my... It hasn't updated yet. Area 6 is currently blank. Okay, never mind then. Um, 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 and then we can look at the eternal log, alternal logs at some point too. Remind me to do that before the stream is up. I think it's pretty clear that we have to get in that rocket somehow. Are you ready to try this? Am I ready to try this? Don't worry, Master Webin. I'm not going to look at any rewards on the NSO for anything. Don't worry. Am I? I'm a rocket man. Is all your hero gear the way you want it? Sure is. Captain saying this is the final confirmation. Are you really super ultra mega sure you're ready? Uh, uh They keep asking me. I'm not sure anymore. <laughs> yes, I'm ready. All right, Gramps has to be up there somewhere. Are we going to the moon? But there's so much fuzzy ooze in the way. Blah. Even Small Fry isn't that hungry. I just know this would be useful if we can combine it all. You've always got the answer, Agent 2. It's totally worth a shot. Let's do it. What kind of vehicle are we making here? The power of chowder? Okay, we are making like some sort of motorcycle? Question mark? What the fuck is that? What? Aw, hugs. Brug! Wow. Look out, Fuzz. Here comes the captain. Um, just so we're aware, this is literally the end game of this video game right now, so. <laughs> Welcome in! What in God's name? Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, this is some anime shit! <laughs> we made like a giant razor. <laughs> we made like a giant razor. Now then, smoothless aside, let's save Gramps. Dude, honestly, Brooke, you read it at the perfect time. We're about to do the end game here. So if anybody doesn't want to get spoiled on the end game, now would be your time to tune out. But if you have seen the lat the the end game and you want to watch me do the end game right now, um, listen to the music. Should I recognize this? Talk to the captain. Cap, Captain, are you okay? You simply can't go on. <clears throat> you simply can't go on? You sprained a tentacle? Well, we won't let you down. We'll go on without you. Come on, Agent 3, let's... Wait one hot minute. That's right, it's us. 
You didn't think we we're gonna just give up, did you? Tell me you didn't. Giving up is for the weak. Do we look weak? So, last chance. <clears throat> if you don't want to tangle with a deep cut, put down the treasure and walk away. <laughs> what they said. Oh, that thing? Yeah, we're done with it. It's all yours. You're done with it? Done, done with, with treasure? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Plenty. <laughs> Mood. <laughs> but don't worry about that. If this pile of junk makes you happy, you can have it. This is a trick, right? You expect us to believe you're just going to give us the treasure after, well, everything? Wait, why am I fighting this? Wow, thanks. <laughs> I feel kind of not good about each of us fighting you to the death. Our bad. And you're just giving us this? Seriously, such a boss move. Actually, why don't you be our boss? New boss, can I get a raise? <laughs> wow. Boss Marie? Ah -ha -ha. <laughs> ah -ha -ha. Looks like you have your own employees now. Have fun with that. Oh, I'm going to have to approve their time cards, aren't I? Dude, this is great. I can't believe they turned out to be so nice and so familiar. Where have I seen them? Now that Agent 2 is the boss of Deep Cut, we should definitely be able to rescue Gramps. This alliance might just work out. <laughs> Ow, owie, ouch. Do you feel like we're being watched? By Deep Cut specifically? Eh, whatever. Let's just get... Wait, no, what? What? Where did they go? <laughs> Where are they, actually? They just show up and then, I don't know, gone, I guess? And no one is worried about the captain, yeah. Well, that's what happens when you save the world. Can't stop thinking about poor Gramps all alone up there somewhere. We've got to focus and move on. You're our only hope, Agent 3. I mean, we're standing right here. Yeah, don't forget about us. Let's go. Oh, sure. Now they want to help. Deep paper cut. <laughs> Alterna Space Center, entrance. Calm yourself, then watch and learn. All weaponry is strictly prohibited beyond this point. Pets and or sidekicks are allowed. Oh, it's the Grizzco Lobby. Oh. I did not recognize the tune. Whoa, they took everything. All of your hero gear. Oof. I mean, we didn't exactly surprise them, did we? We just charged right in. If we're setting a trap for you... I'd be down, <laughs> I'd be doing the, yay, the trap work dance right now. I may do it anyway. It's a fun dance. I see your gear. You should be able to get it back if you make it through this. What do you think, Agent 3? You have your small fry. Are you good to give it a try? Would you be going in there fresh out of ink? Who am I kidding? Of course you would. All right, touch. And touch. Touch. Oh, you, we're infiltrating. Blow. Blow them. Mmm. Phrasing. It didn't actually blow up. Or maybe it did and it came back. Well, there we go. Well, look at that. Between Agent 3 and Small Fry, who needs fancy weapons, right? Oh, sweet God! <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> All right, come back, small fry. Tippy tappy, tippy tappy. Two vaults, but are there any keys? Great question. Final level, Liam. I saw the sunshine reference also. The Manta Storm, are you kidding me? Like what, a, what? I can't believe I didn't get spoiled on that. I'm so glad I didn't. Okay, so that, does that just go back up? Is this like a, wait, can I not, hold on. Oh, I gotta swim through it, duh, it's ink. 
It's like a maze. Oh, there's a key. One key down. Honestly, that gives me hope that Nintendo hasn't forgotten about Sunshine either. And also, I mean, it makes sense that there's a Sunshine reference in this game. Like, the parallels are, you know, pretty obvious. But also... Wait, 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 no. Oh, no, small fry. Hold on. It's fine. It's fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Open the box. Open the box! <laughs> okay. But you're putting down ink instead of washing it away, which turns out is equally as satisfying it is. Yeah, they, um... I mean, yeah, the, the parallels, though. It makes sense. And I'm glad to see it. And I'm glad... I'm just glad to see that... At, like, any kind of recognition for one of my favorite Mario games. Super Mario Unshine. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, lol. Lamau, even. Uh, and then we need to put you on there. Oh. Oh no. Mistakes were made. Here, I'm gonna do this instead. <laughs> you didn't ink that through, did you? Hey, get on the button. My dude. Seriously, I'm just glad they didn't forget Sunshine existed. Honestly, it feels like they've given more love to Sunshine than some of their other games lately. Like, just the fact that the, the Mario HD collection there had an improved version of Sunshine. A widescreen version of Sunshine. Upscaled. Everything. Like, that kind of thing. Feels good. Feels good. Sunshine was a fantastic game. Even with its jank. We sneaking now, boys. Are we sneaking? Go on, little friend. Go on without me. Uh. Uh. Can Josh Jepson solve the puzzle? Uh. Um. Uh, um, uh, um, um, but I don't have a gun. They didn't have a gun. There's no guns. They didn't give me my hero gear. I was a huge ding dong and took a long time to figure this out. Okay, don't tell me. I'm not looking at chat anymore. I want to figure it out. I want. I want to be the ding dong tonight. Where my gun at? Is 
Is there more than meets the eye around these parts? Did I miss something? Oh, man. Um. Oh. <laughs> okay, that didn't take that long. <laughs> I figured it out. <laughs> That's not that's not immediately obvious. That's not immediately obvious, to be honest. All right, now we now 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 we're in business. Now the real shit starts. You and Small Fry did great, but it must be a relief to have your gear back. Don't you think we should get a move on? Look for another way in, Agent Three. There's got to be a, one around here. All right, Grizz, or whatever your name is. What's the deal with these ropes? Oh, Pinky. Ropes? Those are corporate engagement facilitators. I simply require a representative of Earth like you. Don't you see? A representative of Earth? If you really do want to help. Oh, I didn't read that. Never fear. You'll be free soon. And together we shall bristle forth into fuzzy and profitable new era. Oh, I get it. You've gone fishing, completely out of sea. Com completely out to sea. Jesus, I can read. The problem is that the text goes by automatically, so I can't stop. Okay, none of this is inkable. But I can look. How could they? It's uninkable! Spaceship. Oh. I bet the speedrun of this game is nutty. I bet it is. Wow, we got a ways to go with this, this area too, don't we? Space Center Hangar. Warning, this is a restricted area. Entry is prohibited. All routes closed uh, while launch sequence initiates. Have a nice day. <laughs> oh, thanks, thanks. At least they're nice about it. Awesome. Satisfying. Satisfying as fuck. <laughs> Yo! Game is like, remember all the weapons? Here they are. <gasps> shark! It's a shark! Get shark, motherfuckers! <laughs> Jump and slam. Oh God, this is so satisfying. Ink me, ink me up, daddy. Ink me up, daddy. Oh, I'm gonna burst. Got him. Yeah, this is yeah, it's the wreck their shit part of the game. It's like a boss rush, except it's a it's a wreck wreck shit rush rush. Words are hard at this hour.
Oh, another crab. But for what? Kratos. What am I doing? That is so dumb what I just did. I was like, I'll just ride that. <laughs> Great. And yet I lived, yeah, somehow. I lived, bitch. So, okay. <laughs> the answer is yes, I do want to ride it. But like, on the side. <laughs> Don't be a dumbass. I feel like I might have just wasted my crap. That's okay. Listen to the song, you might recognize something. I did not recognize anything. Okay, but we had a few false gramp signals. I'm pretty sure, but I'm pretty sure he's on that launch pad. Oh, and how in the world are we supposed to get over there? I don't know for sure, but if we can, if uh, we can get into this building on the right, maybe we can find an answer. Mammals and marine creatures have traded places, and not for the better. As CEO, I must be the one to restore balance to nature. For now, I'll let the fuzzy ooze spread and watch the golden eggs pile up. My employees have been extremely diligent. Hey, buddy, you talking to me? Because I ain't got no idea what you're saying. Dude, honestly, this is exactly what I had hoped for for a Splatoon 3 campaign. <laughs> like, I was like, they should really expand on this Mr. Grizz guy. <laughs> and they totally did. Can't, can we turn the light on or something? We'll have to rely on other senses, like sharks do. Oh. Okay. It's weird how little plot there was prior to this and how much this managed to develop, right? Well, a lot of the plot is told through, like, the alterna logs that you unlock throughout the game, right? And some of the, like, the bonus lore stuff. So it's very much, like, like the subtle lore until the end game, which is how it was kind of in Splatoon 2 as well. A little bit. Whoa, this is scary. Just flying in here out of nowhere. Out of the darkness. Get that Octo shit out of here. Oh, wait, I'm an Octo. Hold on. <laughs> All right. See ya. Bye, guys. Oh, they're just mad. <laughs> they're just mad. Oh, wait. No, they're dropping in. <laughs> I killed them all already. <laughs> oh, I should have used them on these guys. My Trizuka. That's okay. This elevator, elevator getting bigger? Oh, I guess it did. It added an extra elevator. Oh! 
Octolings. It's time for all of you to leave the mortal plane. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just screaming now. It's the middle of the night. <laughs> Yeah, super jump camp them, no, no doubt. All right, here we go. Onwards and downwards. We climbed, well, we climbed, we unclimbed, and now we're here. I hope Gramps really is at the, uh, the launch pad. I'm still not sure how to get there. Hey, I can see a pipe that's connected to the rocket. Good eye, Fry. The pipe is definitely big enough for Agent 3 to fit through. What could go wrong? Very brave to volunteer Agent 3 like that. <laughs> I mean, I've been through all this. It's been bugging me. Why were you after the treasure anyway? Because treasure? Doing it for Splatsville. Not everyone there is as fresh as we are. Some of them are really hurting. That's right. We plan to sell the treasure and divide the profits among the needy. We'll keep a shallow. What? Something. Whoa, you're actually heroes. And here we thought, well... Oh, God. See, it's going to buy too fast for me to read it out loud. Sorry. That's great. What a great what a great turnaround there. Good for them. Shallow cut. There we go. Haha. -ha, the opposite of a deep cut. This music is wild. All right. Here we go. Whee! Where she stops, nobody knows. Follow the yellow ink line. Follow the yellow ink line. Follow, 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 follow the yellow ink line. The spirit lifter. Steerage. Oh, we're in. Oh, man, this is where I ra when I raided Liam when he was at the end of the thing. I was like, oh, God, I got to go now. You were here. Looks like I've got more climbing to do. We'll be rooting for you. Safely from the ground, far, far below. Where it's safe. Dude, I'm sorry. I'm just listening to the music right now. It's a jam. I, I take it they wanted me to use the crab there for a second, but <laughs> I'm good. Such heavy, heavy security in here. I hate that. Oh, that's right. I got it mistaken for a grind rail. Oh, good thing I just got a checkpoint. Touch fuzzy, get fuzzy. Oop. Oh, little janky jump there. I don't know why I thought this would help.
rude. It shut us out. Get, I uh, guess that weighs a no-go. I didn't even notice the great zapfish. Oops. That's my bad. Sorry, I looked at chat, you know. We go, we're going back and, back and forth here. It's okay. The great, I'll, I'll look at it in the VOD. I, I, that's why we record these things, right? Hmm? Hold on. Oh, look at those floating energy cores. And that's a switch. Look at me. I'm helping. <laughs> okay, hear me out. We get the energy cores. We flip the switch. And then something. Right? <laughs> we won't know unless we try it. Let's steal them. Unfortunately, they just let me use it forever, apparently. Oh. I need to readjust. Nice. Oh! Clever. Systems, systems activated, releasing bulkhead number one. Now we're getting somewhere. There's still another bulkhead and more energy cores. Imagine if I had to do this fast. Oh, man. Oh man. Uh 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 <laughs> I'm struggling. Ah No <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, Jesus! Stop! <laughs> there we go. Oh, I just still didn't get that, though. God damn it. Could have been worse. Man, this is a lot harder than it looks on the surface, to be honest with you. Got him. That was fire. Thanks, man. I think that's the way out. I bet it opens the same way as the bulkheads. Keep cool. You're almost there. Man, if I had known this was going to be like a whole thing, like I, I probably would have saved it for another day. So I'm glad that we're here because I'm going to end up finishing it because of that. But it's just getting so late now. Like, shit. We're going on four hours of stream. It's exciting though. I just have nothing to say. <laughs> I have nothing new to add to this stream. Pretty 
satisfying. Where's the button? Where the, where the button? Is it down there? It's pointing down there. Oh, yeah, totally is. Here we go. There are three components to my business plan. The vessel, the spirit, and the wisdom of ages. Is someone taking notes? What are you blathering about? Hey, hey don't come any closer. Your brain, ensconced though it may be in your hideous form, contains the beautiful something. Leave my brain out of this. Hey, what's that for? Get that away from me. Ah! Gramps. Gramps! Seems like they are, things are going kind of badly for Gramps now. Yeah, I hope his brain can hold out until we get there. Please hurry, Agent 3. To be a visionary in a business and in life, one must be prepared. I uh, must rather leverage the suffering of my employees to a brighter, fuzzier future for all. Jesus Christ. Mr. Grizz is on some... some, some Something. <laughs> Gramps, we're here to save you. What? what? <gasps> oh no! He's dead, dehydrated in his prime. Whoa, wait, that's Mr. Grizz? He's so cute. <laughs> hey, you overgrown furball. Turn Gramps back into Gramps. Valued employees, we appreciate your feedback. However, it will not be implemented at this, at this time. What's that supposed to mean? He's so big and round and cute, actually. Except that he's got, like, blank eyes, which doesn't make him... It makes him less cute. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, Houston? <laughs> Houston, we have a problem. There's a large, round bear thing hanging off of our rocket the end of the world as it's the end of the world as we know it and I feel fine as per my memo I will be coating the planet in a fuzzy ooze and in effect to restore balance don't call it Hermageddon <laughs> HR doesn't like it <laughs> no the rocket Gramps <gasps> Gramps he's he's all tried up but how? Uh-oh. Oh, he's kind of back from one tier. Huh? <sighs> Somebody got the drop on me. Anybody else feeling a bit parched? Also feeling a bit lighter and way flatter? Talking squid jerky, you're alive? Thank goodness you're, uh, all right. Ish. <laughs> hey, wait, we're still in danger. The rocket, the fuzz. But we'll never catch that rocket. It's impossible. What can we do? Hold up a sec. Sounds like you folks need some help. And Deep Cut is here to steer the spotlight. Swirl it up, eels. Yo, let's go. Whoa. Your turn, Master Mega. Yo, let's go. Oh, shit. <laughs> the ultimate short. Stay fresh up there, kid. Go, Agent 3. 
The fate of the world is in your hands. You too, little small fry. Bro. Dude, I've got goosebumps now. Riding a shark into space, dude. Are you kidding me? Laser sharks. They came from outer space. It's a song. Wait, where's Mr. Grizz? I see salmon eggs. Oh, boy. We're going to fight him with salmon eggs. Well, well. Such dedication to your work. I think you've earned yourself a break. Now come here so I can break you. Oh, my God. Whoa. Oh, dude, this is awesome. This music is t is terrifying, actually. <laughs> it's the it's the freaking oh my god! It's the freaking uh, the salmon room music. Uh, oh, I see. He's a little weak spots. I'm hitting him. Oh, I gotta shoot him. I'm an idiot. I have a video gun. A video gun. That's not what I wanted to say at all. My words are not happening. Go! Ooh. You're not clocking out. Just yet. Or something. Now what? What? Oh, this is awful. More fuzzy ooze. Eat, eat the pimples. What was I trying to say? Something gun. I was going to say I had a gun. And then it came out as video gun because video games, I guess? I don't know. It's weird. What a weird way. What a weird thought pattern. Oh, oh, it's turning. Oh, it's it's turning. It's turning. Oh, I recalled my friend too early. Shoot. Didn't mean to do that. Two deaths. That was a dumb death, though. Oh my god. Oh, now it's rotating that way. Stop this madness. Jesus Christ. Survive the spin. No more spin, please. How many do I have? Ow. All right, boy number two. Ah, setback. But this is a growth something. I wish it would not go by so fast. Jesus. Growth industry. Mmm, jelly. This is like some fucked up Winnie the Pooh. This is like if Winnie the Pooh was a kaiju. Winnie the kaiju.
Oh, God. Yeah, I'll just wait. <laughs> I'll just wait. You can just scream away. Scream into the void, please. Yeah, let's go! Ding, ding, ding. In space, no one can hear you wail. You are proactive, aren't you? But it's time to clock out. In a few moments, I will do something. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Where did they get a spaceship? What is this? Where did this come from? Wait, it, oh, it's uh, Octavio, isn't it? It's DJ Octavio! No way, dude! <laughs> You're not dropping this beat on our turf. Let's go! <laughs> Listen up, it's going down. Rep at the Splatlands, we are deep cut. Ready up there? Let's bust that bear. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Octavio Redemption Arc, let's go. We drink, shiver, fry, and big man. Go, our turn. Hit it. That heavenly melody. Congratulations, your small fry has evolved into <laughs> Oh, look at it. Look at the big boy. Oh, they grow up so fast. <laughs> Kaiju buddy. Large fry. Huge fry. Whoa, small fry and Mr. Gridge got hugeified. They're so adorable. <laughs> the bear is filled with fuzzy ooze. Eliminate the fuzz balls to help huge fry. Uh, just quoting the captain down here. He's trying to deliver the fuzzy one uh, ooze himself. You've got to stop him. Return of the mammalians. You ooze, you lose. Go back to Earth or Weiner. <laughs> you ready, Octavio? Pilot hatch unlocked. Fuzzballs, meet my ink vac. Hop in, Agent 3. You heard him. Steer the Octobot King and vacuum those fuzzballs up. We only have three minutes and 33 seconds before he slams into the earth. Hurry. Uh, okay. What? Whoa. <laughs> Dude, look at Huge Fry. He's so menacing, actually. There are more fuzzballs up ahead. Get the next one. Dude! What the fuck? This game went this, from 0 to 60 so fast. I'm gonna need you to not punch my son. Ouch. Ouch. It's fine. It's fine. Whoa, this is so rad. Oh, I gotta get the butt. Gotta get the butt. Get the booty. Get the booty. Oh, before these stupid stamps get me. Come on, come on, come on. Suck. 
Suck the booty! Suck the booty! <laughs> Whoa. All right, one more on almost his crotch. I mean, I don't know if it's one more. But there's another. Don't touch any of those things. Get out of here. Dude, the transition from, like, being in the ship to fighting these guys is so smooth. I just tried to throw small fry, and then I realized. <laughs> I was like, small fry, please help. Oh, wait, you're busy. Got all the fuzz balls. Now what? He's still on the move. I'll tell you what. We fire that fuzz right back. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Let's go, dude. It seems all of my work has been for nothing. The times have changed. The world can never be as it was. Moving forward is the future. I suppose this is it, then. You will not receive severance pay. You will not receive severance pay. Oh my God. He did deflate. He was full of all that ooze. Small fry. Oh, he's back. I was supposed to die first. Is there like a bonus cutscene? The return of the mammalians? Hello? <laughs> There's a bad end, just like the Octo expansion. I didn't even know there was a bad ending in the Octo expansion. Listen up, it's going down. Repping the Splatlands, we are Deep Cup. Anarchy Splatcast, we're live. Here we go. You lip sync, we drip ink. Shiver fry, big man. I can barely contain myself. What is it, big man? Breaking news! Is this about the return of the great Zapfish? No, oh, yeah, I almost forgot about that. Yeah, me too. I actually missed it. I didn't even see it somehow. Is that how it always looked? Who cares? It's safe. Yay! Is that all you got, big man? What's next? No, there's more. Broken news! That's breaking news. So hurry up and break it already. Ooh, let me guess. This is all about the new Squid Sister single, right? Because if so, yeah, I've heard about it. And yeah, I'm big mad about it. Wait, it says Squid Sisters on the label, but look at these two. Is it really them? Th that's Boss Marie and her, her assistant lady. They're the Squid Sisters? Yeah, where have you been? <laughs> Forgive us, boss ladies. They really are our bosses. Deep Cut will be uh, will open for the Squid Sisters anytime. When are we going on tour? Yes, great idea, Shiver. Deep Cut and Squid Sisters World Tour! Well, until then, let's just play the latest Here's wave goodbye. Catch you later. Oh, that's the hologram concert. Yeah. That's right. They did do that. Wow.
was a really enjoyable endgame <laughs> by like a lot. <laughs> I didn't know if they could top Splatoon 2's endgame. Or Octo Expansion's endgame, anyway. Ink the credits. Wait, what? <gasps> Excuse me? Yeah, now I have Champions Road. I have heard about this. I don't know what that entails, but that will be for another time. I like how you're just firing it into space and it just floats around. That's pretty great. And if you hit the 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 words, it like bursts. I also love how all these names are in like a graffiti like style. Well, not all of them, but most of them. Like all the leads. Yeah, I've heard it's really, really tough. Hal described it as like a... Whatchamacallit. Well, I guess, no, just like Champion's Road. That's what he said. Like a, like a very... Um, like the last level of Mario Odyssey or Galaxy 2 or whatever. That you unlock afterwards. I'm just gonna listen to this music. Oh, Champions Road is 3D. Well, you know what I mean. The like a bonus and hard level is what it is. Keep an eye out for something. Oh, hey, there's Mr. Grizz. <laughs> he float. You know, it is, it, it's a quality campaign like that, that really makes me feel like they deeply have, lo like, love this game. There's a lot of love poured into this game. And it's not even just that the campaign, but, like, every, every inch of this game is so good. There's very few things I, I would say are bad about this game. Very few things. And one of them is, like, the online connection. <laughs> but besides that... Like, the connection dropping from time to time. And it doesn't even happen that often to me. Yeah, this can yeah, campaign was way better than the Octo expansion, which as for me, I feel is hard to top because like that I had so much fun with our Octo expansion, but they took everything from Octo expansion that they learned from that campaign and applied it to this. Special thanks. Squid, little Octo, 
Lil Fry. <gasps> Yay! Oh, thank you for playing. You're welcome. Anytime. Yay! Aw, oh, dude. What a great game. I, I, I was sad it took me so long to beat, but honestly, truthfully, I wanted to wait until I was fully settled in my new place and like gone through all the moving shit before I finished up this game. And I'm glad that like, I, this is actually the first week that I feel fully settled too. So like, this is kind of meaningful to me to like, I don't know, it's great. So I feel really good now. That's awesome. And I got the hero suit stuff. And I got a sticker, cute. And I got a secret kettle. Oh God, <laughs> that's the that's the extra hard bonus level. Favorite moment? All of the entirety of that end fight. <laughs> as soon as like, as soon as like the mo the moment that like it hit me was when like the final phase of that first fight where you're on the the rocket and it like kicks the music kicks in that that moment right there and then everything from there on out i was like yes go to salmon run got a new badge try it on your splash tag oops that's the shoal oops i'm i'm getting i'm getting uh no 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 i don't wireless no i'm good Grisco. Real quick, look up at the look. Go look up the bad ending. Okay, I'll do that in a second. Everybody wants me to do like five, five different things at once. Oh, bad time for the map to update. <laughs> Great. I guess it's just because I find I connected to the internet. They actually updated like an hour and a half ago, but what the fuck? Oh my god. He's so tiny in the mouth of the, the the huge the huge fry. He's so tiny. Num num. <laughs> num num. Amazing. Okay, so back to the square. Is there any diff anything different over here? What's up, ladies? Yeah, this is where they are. Yay! Hi, guys! Big man! Big man. Um, now what, sh what should I do next? Now go back to Alterna. <laughs> what do I want to do? I want to go to bed soon, <laughs> but, oh, hey, there's this. Agent 3, Agent 3! I'm so glad you're okay. I mean, I knew you would be. Nicely done. We saw it all. The daring, the bravery, the incredible skills. Who knew Small Fry could do that? Uh, uh, and, and you were there too. <laughs> yeah, Agent 3 basically saved the planet. Does anyone, does anyone other than us even realize that? Being a hero, well, it's a real trip. A voyage, if you will. Some kind of tour where you go places. Booyah! I can do that. <laughs> Well said, Gramps. Oh, and the 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 captain was full of praise for you too. There was a heartfelt nod of approval. Here, here. Well, until next time. Stay fresh. Oh, that's great. Cool. Okay, so I do have the bonus level, but I'm not going to do that now. Obviously, it's over there. We'll we'll go to that another time. Um. And I do have the alterna logs that I can read, which I will also do when I do the other thing. So remind me then, because I don't want to do it right now. If you play a quick turf war, one last change you can see with little Judd. Okay. 
peek behind the camp. Oh, hey, there's the, wait, hold on. That's the old Grisco stat um, radio. Relive memories? Oh, it's, oh, this is how you can do the, 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 the rest of the, oh, that's great. Yeah, I went to see the new one. A second ago, Liam, you must have missed it. Um, how do I get out? How do I leave again? Where's my button? Back to Splatsville. Um, go check the shell drone. Where is that? Where is that? Don't forget to look up the bad ending. Not like we'd let you. That's true, yeah. One thing at a time, y'all. Oh, the Zapfish is up there now. That's great. I'm not going to do another turf war for the small little judge change. We'll see that in the future. You got the bad ending? Okay, I have to look up the bad ending now. So, one sec. that do I have a good way of showing that yes all right I guess I should mute the game which was already too loud to begin with because I turned it up for the music in the credits um, is this it this is it right this is it okay here we go Thanks, Beard Bear. <laughs> Fitting name, really. Return of the Mammalians! You ooze, you lose. Go back to Ursa Weiner. You ready, Octavio? Plattsville, we failed you. What the crap? Whoa. <laughs> On that day, a massive fuzzball was born in space. <laughs> Mammals are back, but at what cost? <laughs> the mammals are back, but at what cost? <laughs> oh, man. That was beautiful. What a time. And we still have that bonus level to do. So there's still shit to do. That's great. I did not expect this stream to go on for almost five hours, actually. The fact that it took me that long... Like so much, there was so much more to that end game that I was anticipating. To be honest with you, good soup, good game. Ten out of ten. I'm glad I finished it. It feels good to finish a thing. That's why I was like, I was kind of gunning for it today because I was like, I know I'll feel really good when I finish it. And and I played every level with every weapon. So, I get that extra double satisfaction.
I did first try the final phase. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Even the rail one? Yup. I did every level with every weapon imp possible. I mean, I died a lot in a few of them, but yeah, I think I did everything. I was very, I very 100%ed that run there. <laughs> But that's that's the sign of a good game. Like, I'll only like 100% a game really if I'm deep deep into it. Otherwise, I you know I'm halfway through a game or something. You know, so like, it was good. Bamboozler Tiger practice must have been crazy. No, <laughs> nothing. No, to be honest, nothing really stood out to me as that difficult. <laughs> There wasn't a single level that I was like, oh, yeah, I remember that being really hard. But I'm sure, like, if I went back and looked at some of the VODs, I'd be like, oh, I struggled with that. But, like, you know, I don't want to brag. But I'm good at video games now, guys. Shit. Where are you in the card game? Because you could potentially see the thing uh, with mini. See the thing with mini Judd. Uh, not, I'm not. I haven't played very much of it, honestly. Which is too bad because I really liked it. We've turned a page. We need we need a Josh is good at video games song now. Who's gonna make the Josh is good at video games song? Huh? Josh is good at video games. I mean, it doesn't have to be that tune. It could be more epic than that, actually. I don't know. What? Nah. What do you mean, nah? Dan the Enigma, probably. He a musician. The Splatoon Master. Eh, I don't know about all that. When we played Splat Zones, I think we won all our matches. I'm, I think I'm really good at Splat Zones. Like, if I can, you know, if I've got a team that is competent at playing the game, we can usually win. In almost every time I've played. So, like, yeah. I'm not great at any of the other game modes, but Splat Zones, I think I'm pretty good at. One win does not constitute a song, Jepson. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> it's true. Splat Zones is the best ranked mode, though. I need, yeah, I need more practice for the other three. I should play more of them. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna like force myself. Now that I've done the campaign, I'm gonna force myself to play some of the other, um, the game modes more often, so that I can get better at them. Anyway, I do believe it is time to wrap this up. For a couple reasons. One, I gotta pee again, because like my bladder is small and shitty. Uh, and two, it's almost 1 a.m. And three, we're we're super done. Like there's not we're done. We're done. <laughs> we're super done. I'm done. But I had a lot of fun. My favorite joke of the night was Winnie the Kaiju. My, it's my favorite joke of the night. <laughs> Winnie the Kaipu. <laughs> Who are we going to raid? Who are we going to raid? And what are we going to raid with? We can't raid with Winnie the Kaiju. Suck something. Suck the booty. Sure, suck the booty. Suck the booty. Well, it doesn't have to be all caps. Just make the low. There we go. Something like that. Um, yeah, I guess we can raid John. I rarely get to raid John. Let's do it. Thanks for watching, guys. Yeah, don't explain it. No spoilers for anybody in John's chat, because I know that, that John's got a lot of Splatoon people in his audience, so don't spoil it for them. Um, this is my schedule for the week. We got Breath of the Wild tomorrow at 8. Same time we started today. Same time we started today on Friday is Twilight Princess. 
Uh, 3 p.m. Eastern on Saturday, more Breath of the Wild, followed by Sunday, Better Kazooie 100% Crowd Control, 6 p.m. Eastern Time. Be there. I dare you. I dare you. I double dog dare you. In fact, I triple dog dare you. Oh, shit. Okay. Anyway, thanks so much. Go suck the booty. Have a great night. Uh, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.